Yo, what's up guys, it's Barox and you're back at it again and like usual on Saturday, let's get straight into the new aimdocs update and to start off with we have the new honey badger the first new weapon in almost a year so this is actually really exciting it's an ar but i would consider playing it more like an smg as it has a pretty high fire rate good damage but really high recoil because you can't put a muscle attachment on a honey badger after all the skin it comes with is also pretty nice in the background you can always see the first of it the second one is a free grindable skin you can get by getting 500 kills in own guns or arcade anyways next on next on we have four new skins them being night mud paintballer ken vibes and jungle fight let me know your favorite in the comments now we have a pretty nice change as the daily quests have gotten a massive upgrade some of them being progressive quests now which means you can now complete them multiple times to earn extra cash on the screen you can see an example of how one of those looks next on into the weapon balancing which only has one thing this being that the melee lunge speed has been adjusted to be a lot more smooth rather than the instant snap we are used to and all i can say for the it for sure is interesting into the death notes the space kermit has been moved into the knife category where you have a chance to get it for 10k the hit markers have a new effect on kill which is really satisfying <laughs> to say the least and the old four camos we had before the new ones have been vaulted so we can't get them anymore and lastly there have been some matchmaking adjustments to make it even more smooth and the last thing is the bug fixes which once again is only a few dead reload fixes this time being the ump bison tommy gun p90 bren and the mg42 all right this has been it with today's update it's a pretty good update to be honest the honey badger is literally made for youtube videos it's pretty smooth looking and also feels pretty nice but just see in the gameplay we have so let's hop around right into that all right and here we are already in the first round i actually did not expect it to be tdm but hey here we are and it's 8 a.m as well which is fun he just despawned right in front of my eyes what i mean but yeah like i said this thing is very much a close range gun the recoil is stupid and the damage drop off is actually pretty significant that is actually quite the damage drop off but in close range this thing actually kind of fries and you use a heartbreak i already have a very bad feeling about what's gonna happen to you use a channel leg and you can't hit anything well, this is fun. But yeah, like I said, this thing is definitely a close range map. Like, close range AR. It's more like an SMG. So I would treat it like an SMG, not like an AR. I guess this is basically what it is. Die. But other than this, this thing actually kind of fries in people. Because this... It, I swear to God. Stop it with that China leg already. See? And because of the new China leg nerfs, I could have one... I one tapped him. Because pretty much any gun in this game does over 20 damage. But yeah, like, I mean, you can see on range, this thing kind of suffers because the recoil is really high. But other than that, I like the reload. The sound descent is amazing in this gun. And this is actually just a weird feeling for me because you guys know we, we haven't had a new AR in so long, like a new gun in general. I mean, this thing fries if you hit headshots. And I can't imagine this thing being with Extendo Mac actually being very good. And by the way, guys... Uh, you unlock this gun at level 41 and it costs 10k so it's on the cheaper end especially with the new quests it should be easy done but you can see this thing fries i would consider this thing matter but i think it's but it's still worse than the ak on long range at least on close range you have to hit perfect headshots with the ak to beat this thing but if you don't hit headshots this thing beats you because the higher fire rate just fries people so fast I still can't get over that this sound isn't actually that good. So to whoever modeled this, good job. You did an amazing job. I like this thing a lot. Even though the view model could be a little more zoomed in for my taste. But this is just how aimbox is. I like just I just like guns closer up. They take away less space on your screen. But other than that, I think it's actually pretty nice. Oh. Yep. I'm definitely gonna be hitting some new clips there. So I expect a new clip. So I expect a new montage to drop at one point. Because this thing is very satisfying. The thing is, it will definitely freshen the game up a little bit, especially because I want to get the skin. And I will make a separate video for it, because, you know, it's free content, basically, getting these skins. I just hope... I think this is actually going to be the only one we're playing. Probably have to check the time. I with every single bullet in literal hell. And of, this is so unfortunate. I with every bullet right there. If it didn't with, like, every like 20 bullets in a row, I would have actually won all of that. But hey, it's one death so far. 
And we're in 33 kills. We can actually drop 40 if you like. This is always so awkward when people vote TDM in these lobbies because I have to play them out. But if I play them out, usually the lobby dies because, you know, people don't feel like playing against level 100 tryhard. Guys, see what I mean? This thing is really hard to control. It's actually kind of insane hard this thing is to control. Oh, this guy. Okay. This is the auto fire person. I'm pretty sure that this guy's a mobile player without the fire. Okay, I somehow survived there, so I'm gonna accept that. Why are you guys so greedy with kills now? That's unfortunate. Well, anyways, <laughs> I guess we see us maybe in the next round. If not, we see us in the outro. All right, and here we are in the last round. Night death. This is probably the best map or one of the better maps for this because this is a CQB map. Why is every one of you trying to snipe? You guys don't have the skill for it, so leave me alone and don't body shoot me like every 10 seconds. Oh no. Can we agree? I still don't like channel like users even after the nerf. They're still annoying as hell. Okay, I need to get closer. This thing, I mean, here you can see the recoil. It's violent. This is the best way to describe it. It's a violent recoil. But it's needed because this gun has really high damage. And we don't want another AK-103, do we now? And this thing fries in close range. Like I said, this thing is an actual... Oh, hell no. We're leaving. Guys, don't make this more complicated than it has to be, gay. Okay? Don't make this more complicated. I just want my run to be over fast. So don't be annoying and die. Free letter name. My joke. Free letter names are such a joke in this game, in my opinion. Like, what do you get out of it? Does it look cool? Does it look cool that you have a free letter name? And then you're called Klein, sir. Man, I would never understand people like this. Can we agree? This guy must have out of fire too. There's no way. Yeah, yeah, he's definitely a mower player. Because you can see by his movement. A PC player would not move like that. I mean, good. I mean, probably good mower players could do it. But this guy's level 5 and he's basically moving like a robot. And I have not. The thing is, I haven't played today. So I might have a little problem playing today. So this is going to be funny. Not again, buddy. He's still chasing me. Buddy, you have actual issues. Where's the other guy? Ah, I need to forget. I can't forget that double jumper, so I actually have a bit of vile. Bit of movement abilities there. Uh, open, actually. But this is good. But you can see on long range, an AK will just be so much better than an AR. But this thing is still really good. I would say it probably beats the... I would say it's probably... It's like a mix between an MP7 and an MP40. I don't know why I make this... Why I did this anecdote. Yeah, he's a mobile player. Yep, that confirms it completely because he stopped at the exact moment I got out of his frame. That is retarded as hell. Jesus. And I'm not used to having recoil and guns. Get away from me, mobile player. Stop playing. Stop letting the game play for you. If you're a mobile player and you need this much, then don't play on mobile. And if you can't play on mobile, then don't play FPS games on mobile. Or at least play COD Mobile or something and not this game. For the love of God. This is why I don't like crossplay against games because you have to give other inputs this much advantages, which I find stupid. Like there shouldn't be, like you shouldn't need to give uh, other inputs more advantages just because they are in a, just because they're behind us. It's not our fault that we that they playing against us. It's the developers' fault. Biggest hot take on the off, by the way. But a lot of I actually noticed, noticed that a lot of people don't like crossplay. But hey, this is the life we live in. This is the time we're living in. I mean, I feel, I'm still a very strong undercut that we should have uh, separate servers for every input. But then again, it would probably just kill the g Oh, hello. Well, that's fine. The thing is, I can't get a good angle on this map because I play this map very weirdly. And don't you dare. Come back here. I'm gonna kill this guy once again that sniped me. Well, anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed today's video. And if you did, don't forget to leave a like, comment, and obviously subscribe. It's the best way you guys like to comment on anything. But anyways, I hope you guys have a nice day, evening, or night. I'm Raux, you content creator, and we see us straight in the next one. Ciao, ciao.